most famous people. No, just wait. <laughs> I'm not, not even. Hello? Hi? Yes. Okay. Um, good morning. My name is Pepsi Garcia. I'm here at Baker's Bodega Express. Um, in the city of Baldwin Park. I know that there is the uh, Baker's Bodega in um, Pico Rivera, who is closed at the moment, and it's okay, we are open. Uh, we gladly um, hold our doors open and welcome all of Pico's Rivera's customers here, as well as the location in Anaheim. Uh, we are open. Um, so if you come and you post a picture that you're here, you will get an extra 5% uh, discount. And we also have the same um, items that Pico Rivera offers. The only thing is that our location is a little smaller, but hey, who cares? It makes it more welcoming. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, next thing is the retail sales that we have right now going on. They're super good uh, sales. We have the cream cheese, icing, um, the cookie cutters that are five for a dollar, five cookie cutters for five dollars, so it's about five bucks, well, one dollar each. Uh, full color prints for eight dollars. The tamales, the corn tamales that I'm gonna try to hijack a dozen for us to taste right now are $13.99 per dozen. Um, did I, oh, sorry, I was, okay. The chocolate red, green, and white for Christmas is $3.99 for three pounds or $15.99 for five pounds, as also as the um, color, candy color for chocolate is $3.99. And then we have the flower, the mes maseca. See, my Spanish is not that good. Um, is on sale. So those are our retail discounts. However, you know, you're more than welcome to take advantage of these also. You're ready? Um, we have a pop-up class this Saturday in, with our instructor, Kathy. She's going to be teaching, um, you're going to learn how to make the cookie batter, the dough, as well as bake it and decorate it. Um, and there is the cookie and then Miss Kathy. She also did this class um, in New Orleans, no, I'm sorry, she did it in Atlanta, Georgia. So it's a very well-known class for her. Um, and we're taking students up until I believe Saturday morning, and it is $45, but however you learn everything from scratch to end earning. Uh, next week's demo will be a Christmas cake. It's a Christmas wreath cake. Um, so I'm going to have one done, as well as make one with you guys here. And that's what it's supposed to look like. Yeah. However, you know me, my stuff doesn't look like the pictures. <laughs> Alrighty. And um, custom ice, buy one, get one. That's what I have okay, my that's right. That's what I have my hand before. I wonder if it was still on. Yes, it's still on. It's just not on the flyer because this is a retail. So this is like more of a like large quantity, but it's, it's still a, the sale. Um, the custom ice is buy one, get one free. And also we have the flavor of the month this December. It is <coughs> the icing. I'm going to work on a couple recipes and we're gonna put them on the boxes or what have you or have them on the side so you guys can get a little taste of not just that, but you can also enjoy different um, ways of using the product. Alrighty, do we have any questions? Um, all right, now I know I told you guys last week, I am blind, <laughs> so I can't really read the comments. I got a call this morning, my glasses are ready, so I gotta go pick them up after this. So maybe I can see you guys next week. <laughs> All righty. So this week we're gonna do chocolate bark. Um, Gorita, can you melt these? Um, we need to take the spoon out or else it's gonna catch on fire. Um, melt those for a good uh, third, 25 seconds, both of these. All righty. I'm going to, we're going to melt down the chocolate, and we're going to do a couple little things. Um, I brought a whole bunch of different stuff here that I wanted to give you guys um, an idea. This is like an easy out for gifting. Usually when people want to, don't, I'm sorry. 
I'm broke. Okay, I'm a home baker struggling to make ends meet every week, and that's just me. That's the reality of my life. So when I gift every year, my family knows that I give them some baked goods. Um, I can't afford to buy everybody a pair of shoes, what have you. You know, maybe my 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 mom and my um, suegros, but other than that, you get baked goods. Um, and this is a good baked good gift. It's super simple, very inexpensive, and um, it doesn't take a lot of time. I did make a couple of these before the demo started, which is the candy cane demos, and we'll do these. There's a little trick to these. You don't just grab them, and that's the trick I'm going to show you. Also, with the cookie cutters that they're on sale right now, we're going to take advantage of that. Okay? So I need to melt down the chocolate, and I'm using this big bang. And this is actually how much I poured out. It's $19.99 for five pounds. Is it five pounds or three pounds? I think this is three pounds. Three pounds? Manny? Is this five or three? Five or three pounds? That's five pounds. Five pounds. So. Um, oh, even the dark one? Yeah, just the white one. But I'm also using, I'm also using the white. Um, and then I can use these. I'm <laughs> just like <laughs> an easy way out. All right. And then Miss Kathy, come. You're fine. Can you melt this a little bit more, please? Okay, so this is Miss Kathy. She's the one that's going to be doing the or hosting the class this Saturday. Hi. Um, hi. <laughs> <laughs> you taught that class in Atlanta, Georgia, right? Am yeah. I right? Yes. Okay, so yes. Atlanta, Georgia. So she's no out and about. <laughs> How are you? I'm good. I'm you good. should see the flyer they made for you. It's really nice. Oh, oh, oh. oh those are cute. Cheap way out, right? Yeah. <laughs> We're both on the same boat. We're both, <laughs> you know, trying to make ends meet every week, right? Yeah. So. We do the best we can. Um, Kathy used to be the instructor in Pico Rivera. I don't know if you guys were aware of that. Um, and then she relocated her life to the boonies. So now she comes and she's going to be doing some classes here. Um, here, I got it. So let's go on with this. <laughs> Trying okay. to do this part. I'll let you get back. <laughs> I, hope I, I hope I see some of you on Saturday. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You should, you should. We have some stuff to talk about for next month. All right, this should be fine. Okay, so an easy way of doing this is just pouring. You don't really have to weigh it. You're really just going to make sure that you're, if you don't have parchment paper, you can use foil. Um, however, spray your foil okay, with um, the release or parchment paper. Parchment paper is perfect. And I, you know what? I'm going to spray it just because on the sides. Now, for Christmas, I, in my mind, I always think um, candy cane, right? Do you guys think candy cane? All right. Marshmallows, hot chocolate, what have Bailey. you. A what? Bailey. Bailey's, oh God. <laughs> <laughs> La borracha. <No. laughs> um, so I'm going to do a couple different ones. And I'm just going to pour the chocolate in here. And I'm going to need more chocolate. All right. Well. And it doesn't have to be perfect in measurement or reach the pan, because no matter what, you're going to get um, a bark. You're going to crack it later. All right, so I want to do a variety. All righty, here we go. I'm just going to try to get as much as I can.
And you know what? Um, since this has been on the calendar and I've gone to like Target and things like that, I've seen that they're selling chocolate bark um, on, the, on the racks and they're like a dollar, two dollars, three dollars. And to be honest with you, like this is the cheaper way out. I see on Facebook as Christmas crack. Oh, really? They put different things in popcorn. Yeah, popcorn. Because um, the salty with the chocolate. Uh, you know what? When we were out shopping, I was like, oh, I should have got some sea salt. Okay. And I here? forgot. Um, no, I don't think so. Some sea salt sprinkle would have been really good. Alrighty. So to keep it Christmassy, um, I'll, I, this is just crushed up candy canes and just sprinkle them. I'm going to do one line because I want to do a variety. And that's really it. And I don't want to use all of them all because I want to use them for the hearts. So if you guys do these, okay, now the chocolate is very liquidy, so the candy cane is going to sink in a little. If you don't want that, you let it sit for a little bit, and then when you start noticing that the, can the chocolate's already a little drying out, then you pour them on, and then that'll be, um, it'll stay on top, okay? But it's okay. So here's, oh, these are the hot chocolate marshmallows, the... Um, to come in the pieces. So I'm going to put some, oh, put a row of that one. Mina, can you melt more chocolate for me, please? That, the open one in the bowl. It's fine. Just don't put, let's take this guy out. Okay, I am melting. Like I know that um, my friend there got scared last week. You can put this one in the microwave because it's not aluminum. Okay. You can't put the spatula in there because that is aluminum. Or the spoon. Spoon, like, that's aluminum. So that one can go in the microwave. And that's why we're melting them directly on there. All right. And then you just do as much as you want. What would you guys like? Oh, that's it. I have M&Ms, sprinkles, Oreos, pretzels. 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 Peanuts. Now, these pretzels are the pretzels that we sell here that are already broken. Um, they're $1.99 for the box. They're just pretty much um, pretzels that are damaged. So I grabbed some of these and I crushed them up. And that's all I did. So, and if I wanted to get really pretty, I can get the pretzel, the cute little minis, put two, and then one little... M&M um, &M in the center and then it would be Rudolph. And then if I drizzled some sea salt on here, oh heaven. So um, I live in the city of Santa Fe Springs. I know most of you already know that. And during Christmas they have the Santa floats that go around. So um, my daughter and I volunteered last night and the night before. I'm dead tired. I have not gotten a good night's sleep. Uh, peanuts. I kind of want to do the M&Ms with those. I mean the Oreos. So we'll do this. And if you notice how the longer, um, the further out I go, the more the, the items stay on top because the chocolate's already kind of setting. What else? Let's do some sprinkles. But this would look better in white. Ah! This one. I think I didn't have your phone out. <laughs> So I am really behind on my messages because of the, the volunteering and it's, it's um, not just a couple hours, it's hours. So I, I feel like I'm getting messages right now. I mean, I can you put my phone on silent. And you know another thing that I do? I turn my phone 
I, I silence my phone when I'm, work, um, when I'm sleeping. Do you guys do that? Yeah. Um, at first, I never did because I felt like I was going to miss something. But then I noticed that I was just being cranky. I was really cranky. Can you put this in the, in the refrigerator? I don't know. I keep hearing it. All right. So let's do the candy canes first. Because the candy canes, there's a process. I have this. Um, do you, are you putting this up somewhere, Alan? On the web page? OK, we're going to have this up on the web page, which is the, the, the steps on how to do the heart um, candy cane chocolate bar. Um, but if not, I have one. Whoever wants it can take it. And what, you're, what we do, I bought these candy canes at, right here at Dollar Tree, um, which were ideal only because they were small. And I liked it. And you kind of want to get the candy canes that are about, give or take, the same size. You're going to heat your oven up to 250 degrees. And uh, you're going to place them, just a little offset. OK? And then you're going to pinch them later. So we're going to put this one together. And then I got these last night. Is this one broken? This one's broken. Uh, yeah, these have plastics. Not those. These do. Um, I'm the type of blind that can't see close. So that's why. <laughs> yeah, I'm that. I see you guys perfect. But, <laughs> but um, maybe tomorrow I won't. No. <laughs> these are all broken. Big lots have. So let's be a guinea pig. Let's see if they're. Oh, this one's broken too. If we can melt them together. This is Oreo flavor. That's why I wanted to try it. I know. Hmm. You got that at Dollar Tree too? No, I got these at Big Lots. I tell you, I'm a struggling baker who shops at cheap places. <laughs> We're going to be the guinea pig and see if it works. Is this the good one? No, this one's broken too. They're all broken. The whole box was broken. That's why they were on sale. That's why they were at Big Lutz. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I can't really. When will the Jello class be posted online to sign up? Okay, the Jello class with um, what was her name? La señora. <laughs> Silvia. Silvia Castellón. Um. She's going to be hosting a Jello class, and I believe it was January 9th, last week. Um, so we are going to get all the details. I'm going. I'm working on that actually today. So hopefully we can post next this week or next week. Okay, these are broken. Whatever. I'm going to see if they melt together. All right. So. Okay. Please have a timer with you so you don't forget and do what I did, which is forget. Um, make, you put the candy cane in the oven, already preheated at 250, no more than five to eight minutes. I had it for like 10 minutes and it got like this. However, you can reshape it a little, but it won't get back to their pretty rounded shape. And that's how broken it is. So I'm gonna put it in here. Five minutes. Right? We're going to let that sit. And have you guys tasted the Peter Caramel? Has no. probado este? No, no, no. No, you got to pass it around. I'm going to put it on toothpicks because. Has probado este caramelo? I'll get the bigger pieces. You guys got to taste it. This is a caramel that we use for, uh, or recommend for um, the chocolate covered pretzels and so on. Um, I, it comes in this box right here. It comes in this box. I'll show you what it looks like inside. 
It's a big black. Okay? Es lo que se parece adentro. Okay? Um, it's so good. And I don't like caramel. Um, but this is really good. This is the open one that I've been messing with. What do you want me to do? I don't do apples. You don't do that? I could. Mm -hmm. I have a secret. Um, I have, we have, Baker's Bodega Express, will have somebody, who I can't say her name yet. Um, she will come in next January. She'll give a class. I think it's on apples, but I can't say her name. <laughs> and that's my secret, huh? I will, later you'll tell me and I'll, I'll just, just sit there like this and see if you do. <laughs> um, but this is the caramel. You just cut it or whatever, or pull it, cut it. Oh, here it is. I use scissors to cut it off. And it was really little. I'm just gonna move it to the side. I keep looking at my time because I don't want it to go over five minutes. Um, sí, y dura bastantísimo. Um, it's look at how it stretches. It's it's ideal. It's perfect. Sí, sí, sí. Mira. Um, Oh, I'm playing with chocolate. <laughs> caramel. Well, this is caramel, but I'm trying to work with chocolate today. Okay, I have one more minute to make the candy canes. The candy canes is, I feel like it's the cutest, um, yet the longest process. Oh, and the cookie cutters, which I'm going to do at the same time. All right. And you can burn yourself with these. Let's go. Okay. I'm messing with stuff here. Okay. So they are a little melted. So if you see, if I wiggle them, they'll shape however I want. What I want is to pinch the ends right here just to make sure that the chocolate doesn't escape from the bottom. And I want to shape it over here also, just, so just pinch it right here, all right? Now, I don't like this heart. To me, it's like a little blue. I'm gonna transfer it to the cold sheet, because this is hot. And this didn't work, so. That one's still hard. So for this candy cane, I want to make it a little bit more rounder. So what was it, Malia? From what to what? Remember the heart? So let's make it a little rounder. So for Valentine's Day, you can get regular red candy canes? Yes. They have those red hot, red hots right now. And they're red. You could, man, stock up now. And that we have them for Valentine's Day. The jelly belly one. Look at that. That's a prettier heart, right? Very cute. I love it. So can you guys see it? Yeah. On already. So now I'm gonna let this chill out for a little and work and I'm gonna chill. And I'm gonna also do this on here. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a chocolate bark inside the cookie cutter. Alrighty? So let's get my. I don't know if I can do this. Need more color, please. I do, but let me move. Oh, I found my phone. <laughs> um, look at this. I'm going to work on this. These are actually my friend um, sells these. So they're ideal. I love them. If you look at this. Alrighty. My. Is the chocolate? Alrighty. Babe, can you melt this one back down? This is blue. It was white chocolate. Um, here, it's okay, babe. Don't worry about that. Um, 
20 seconds. And I added blue candy color to it. Okay, it's Chef Master's blue candy color. Don't forget, make sure you add candy color. Why? Do you know why? Because of the oil. Right, this is oil based. And the gel is not. It's, I think, water based. So if you add this to chocolate, you're not a problem. If you add the gel color to chocolate, done. Your life will be forever ruined. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your product. <laughs> Thank you. <babe. laughs> all right, so all I did is just white chocolate, and I added um, the candy melt to it. And I'm going to add a little bit more, because I kind of, I feel like it looks like purple. Si? Parece lila, no? Now, will this change the flavor no. of the chocolate at all? No. Not at all. Mm -hmm. It's just making it more. Um, let's just add, and actually the candy melts, are, the, the candy coloring is on sale right now, so um, it's on the, it's perfect. Alrighty, so that's fine, I'll use that. So here's my um, cookie cutter, and I'm going to pour some white chocolate in here, you can do whatever this is, there's, I mean, just because I'm doing this doesn't mean you have to do this. You can do any color. You can do a nose. I don't care. Do whatever. Just send me pictures. <laughs> That's all I ask. Okay. And I want the chocolate to stay inside the cookie cutter. That is why I'm not spraying the cookie cutter. So I'm putting enough in there that I want it to be fairly thick. I might not be able to use these because I want to tap it. Oh, this one's not straight. Tapping it, trying to get the air bubbles out. If there's any, this one really doesn't, but what I'm doing now is just getting it straight. And now I'm going to add some blue, cho white chocolate colored in supposedly blue, but it looks purple. <laughs> Did I get blue? Yeah, it's blue. It's blue. And I don't, it doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't matter there. And now with the toothpick, I'm just going to do like swirls. So. Trash. And I'm going to add some of these sprinkles in here that are supposedly blue. It's going to be an off color. Do we have just, um, white. yeah, white. I'm going to put just the white, um, just the snowflakes. Because those two blues were two different colors. Yeah. It's, see, it's some sprinkles. These are just um, um, snowflake shaped sprinkles. Done. All right. So I'm going to leave that right there. I'm going to transfer my heart. My heart is already at a I good. Like it's really cute, right? And it's not. Um, it's not hot anymore. Like it's it warm. They're different. Oh yeah, the difference in the two yeah. candy canes. This is perfect for Valentine's Day. I'm now. I'm regretting showing you this now. I'm just like. Right. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm just playing. All right. So I'm going to do white chocolate. Is this old? Um, Entonces, ¿puede ser chocolate o candy melts y funciona igual? Yes. I can do chocolate and candy melts. However, I'll be honest with my personal opinion, chocolate taste is better than the candy melts. What do you guys think? Yes. Um, candy melts have no chocolate inside them, or they're not made out of chocolate, so... I got it on the candy. Candy melts, we don't sell candy melts here. Candy melts are the ones that you buy at Michael's, like those. Yeah, they don't. Um, they're, not the same. they're not the same. They're not made out of chocolate. They're waxy. Right. 
And I can do the same with this one. Um, I could put red in here and do the swirly if I wish. What would you guys like in here? Caramel? Peanuts. Oh, peanuts. Oreo. <laughs> I did Oreo on the other one or no? Yeah. No. No? Okay, I'm going to do it on the white chocolate. Let's put some nuts. Okay. Because... Um, Can you get me another bag of white chocolate? Get the super white over there in, in, in the, on the shelf out there in, in the... St. Patrick's Day, you can use those Mina, over there. Green mint to do something like that for St. Patrick's Yes, those, those Andes chocolates that you get at Olive Garden when you pay your bill. That kind. <laughs> All right. So... Now, these are ready. I'm going to put them in the fridge for them to set and pop out the other ones. Done. Uh, what was it like five minutes? It was like ten. Ten minutes? It was really while I was working on the other stuff. There's really no time. Um, now I'm gonna crack it and make it actual a chocolate bark. Let me move this. As long as it's dead, it works. Yeah, chocolate bark. There's no specific shape unless you want it to have a shape. Okay, but. If you want to have a shape, you can cut it. Melt it. 30 seconds. Mina. You. All right. Ready? Oh. <laughs> I, I didn't even, whatever. So look at this. And parchment paper, beautiful, perfect. And it came off on the sides because it had the spring. All right, so now I'm going to get a clean parchment. And who wants? Do you? you who wants to break it? <laughs> take your anger. <laughs> just take your anger out. You can break it. You can break it like, like this if you want, or just hammer it, not really hammer, but um, um, with a rod. Why is my thing reconnecting? Sorry. All right, I'm going to put it in here because I don't want it to go everywhere. Okay, ready? Nice. Done. Wow. And this is where <laughs> no. <laughs> Bob is mean. No. The <laughs> back. Oh, perfect. Your oven. My my. It melted. It melted completely. Done. Chocolate bark. Look at that. See? And I, I did the variety so you guys can taste the difference in them. Um, super simple. <laughs> Put them, you can buy those really cute little tins at Dollar Tree at 99 cent store, um, anywhere. And they're really cute, um, you know, as a background if you do some cake pops. Also, uh, like those drip cakes, or you cupcakes. cupcakes, you put them on the background standing, perfect. If you wanted it to be more standing, um, 
You could try. Okay, well, the chocolate would have to be thicker. We'll put do, uh, bamboo sticks inside it so it'll hold it up for you. Um, if you wanted to, you don't have to. But here's chocolate bark. Yeah, I don't know why. She, she's watching. Anissa's watching me. Let's do it again. Okay. So there's that. Chocolate bark? Anybody? Yes. Let's, let's go around and try that. Oh, I'm so sorry. Since this one's are yeah. Since this one's already sprayed. And grab a couple because there's a bunch of different flavors. All right. Can I have the white chocolate, Mina? I'm sorry, I'm just trying to clean up a little bit of the mess so I don't get all crazy. Let me wash my hands real fast. Okay, we're melting chocolate. Can I have? So, we here sell um, chocolate, different kinds of chocolates. We have white chocolate, brown chocolate, dark chocolate, um, chocolate with no sugar, sugar free chocolate. Dígame. No. Sí, usted como usted quiera. Uh huh. Yeah. For me. Thank you. Okay. Um, we also have uh, Paramount crystals here. If you don't know what Paramount crystals are, um, lifesavers. Hola, from the lawyer's office. Uh oh. <laughs> the lawyer's office is watching us. <laughs> oh, the lawyer's office is watching. Yes. Awesome. <laughs> um. So we sell, we also have packets that are chocolate with a little sack of Paramount crystals inside. If you don't know what Paramount crystals are, they're just um, the, the cocoa, cocoa um, oil, i say, that add, make it, um, if your chocolate's not melting the way you wish, you add a little bit of Paramount crystals and it'll help you with the melting. Here, Bill, can you put this? Um, have you guys? We have not posted um, classes yet. Um, 20 more seconds. We are working on some pop-up classes. Would you like some chocolate bark? Yes, I would. <laughs> Five dollars. <laughs> a discount at the Anaheim store. The pretzel tastes good with that. If we would have added some sea salt on it. Somebody had sea salt here. Um, uh, December, we do not have any classes for December. Um, we're having, we're going to do a, a, a change in dynamics, I guess I want to say, in the classes being offered here. Um, so yeah, no classes in December. Um, good morning. Oh, well, except for this Saturday, we do have a pop-up class with Miss Kathy. She's going to be teaching um, cookie class from scratch to end, and it's going to be a crackle effect. So this can be applied in everything. Um, when are you, go oh, we are located in the city of Baldwin Park. We are on Main, we are on Main Street. Um, if you Google us, we will come up. Our address is 4299 Main Avenue in the city of Baldwin Park. Oh, this is Clark? Okay, so Clark and Maine. And our hours are Monday through Saturday and close Sundays because Manny, Manny needs to rest. <laughs> Alrighty. I'm going to do white now. Okay. I was going to do a layer of white and a layer of brown, but maybe I'll do both. But let me do the white one first. <laughs> this is Armando, if you guys don't know. Armando is the owner of the Anaheim store, so he is also open during the remodel of Pico Rivera, and he also welcomes um, the customers. Anaheim. He's my nephew. 
No, he says Danny he just doesn't want to sing. <laughs> I shouldn't say that. We're on live. We're gonna start. We're gonna start rumors. <laughs> no, you're, he's your. Aren't you his Nino? Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, I'm doing the exact same process with the white chocolate, and now we'll we'll do um, other flavors. And this one I'm going to try to do a little thinner, como usted um, dijo. Este le voy a hacer un poquito más delgadito. What are you making? I'm making chocolate bark. Crack. How much chocolate is crack. the caramel? Chocolate crack. Mm -hmm. Huh? How much is the caramel? Uh, the caramel 21, box, 29, 21.49 for a block of? Five pounds. Five pounds. Five pounds. And it lasts a long time. You can use it for the pretzel rods. Are you guys going to do these for gifts? ¿Lo van a hacer esto para regalos? I like it for Valentine's Day. Okay. For teachers. Teachers, yes. Can you do that? You can do whatever you want as long as you don't get caught. <laughs> <laughs> All righty, so this one I did make a little thinner, um, like my friend here asked if we can make it thinner. Yes, you can. And now I'm going to, I think white chocolate, I'm thinking Oreos. Yeah. Can you come to Hawaii? To can I come to Hawaii? Hawaii? I would love to go to Hawaii, actually. Let's go. Let's, go. Let's do it. <laughs> You're online. That, okay. That is my daughter. <laughs> And she thinks she owns the bank account, I'm but she manager. really doesn't. She doesn't give me <laughs> okay, she is my assistant, though. I do have to get a lot. I, I get more sleep because of her. Yeah. I'll be honest. Alrighty, I'm gonna do Oreos. They have cake shows in Hawaii. Um. Why have only? Yes. The last time I was in Hawaii was in Oahu, and that was in 2000. I don't know. I was a freshman in high school. Seven years ago. Seven years ago. Yeah, she went with me. No, my kids go everywhere with me. They get the option. How about that? They get the option to go. If they want to go, they go. If they don't. Well, that time they didn't have an option because they were too little. But um, now that they're older, she gets the option. Like when I go to the cake shows, I, do you want to go with me? I have finals. Then don't go. But... Oh, yay! Okay, now, would you guys, oh, let's do some M&Ms. Let's throw some M&Ms yeah, in here. Okay, so, so then, um, so then we're going to do the target, right? So how, how are we going to go about it? Right, let's put some M&Ms in here. I, um, we don't have regular pretzels. I know this was. This is. Oh. Can you go get me uh, two little thingies of Rice Krispies? Let me pick them out. See, they do have the Christmas bag, so I do suggest if you're going to do this. Um, I would suggest for you to buy the Christmas ones that come in only Christmas colors, because now you see me and a Walmart and things like that. Um, because then I'm forced to eat the leftovers. You know what I like is the mini ones. Yeah, you know what? I was actually looking for the mini ones and they didn't have them here. Um, my son loves the mini ones. Um, I, I would love to go to Oahu. Hit me up and we will talk. Um, what else? Oh, these are um, yogurt chocolate covered. What were these? The raisin yogurt covered raisins. So I got these at Target. And let's put these on here. These are. Oh, ya se está secando. 
I know. Too much talking. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it is thinner, so se seca más rápido. All right. Let's put that in the... Um, oh, that's it. That's good. Look, we'll put... You're leaving, Armando? Yeah, sorry. You know you want me in Anaheim, huh? Yes, we're supposed to go I know. I, when? To go work? Oh. Um, mm, that wasn't only me. How about that? I got to tell you about that one, but no. When I'm working on something, so I'll let you know. Thank you. I wish I knew you were coming. I would have had you bring me some stuff. I put some Rice Krispie treats for you. You want some chocolate bark, my friend? For your long drive home, Malia? You have facing the top. I know, I'm fixing it. So I will see you. Oh, you'll see yourself. No. If you need me, call me. I'll come. We got to work on January calendar. Huh? No, take them. Um, All right. I want to do a, a, a quick little, is the other ones ready? I want to do two different layer colors so that you guys can see how it's done. Thank you. Call me. All right. Now I want to do one layer of dark ch of milk chocolate and one layer of white chocolate. Okay. So this is how I'm going to do it just so that you guys, and I'm just going to do it really quick. So you guys can see it. Ah! Sí, es el mismo chocolate. Le derritimos, le aumentamos más y le derritimos. Pero, maestra, yo no. Pexi. Me puse roja porque me siento bien roja. Dígame. Lo puede hacer en baño María. Muy cierto. No, no porque después estás hirviendo. Que le estás considerando hirviendo. No le estás. Ya, no se está. Derritiendo al vapor, sino que ya le estás sirviendo. Un poquito así de diferencia, de, por lo menos así. Entre el. No, el, no, 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 nada. Okay. Um, yeah. Solo agua en el. En el, en el saucepan, whatever. Okay. And then. Um, put this in the fridge. What's the best brand for white chocolate? Um, the best brand for white chocolate. I am, but I need to let it chill, and then you add the white. Um, sorry, I lost track of. Put it side or here. Put put my my hinges, Mina, Malia. So who's watching from Hawaii? Malia is her name is Hawaiian. She is not Hawaiian. The name is. What does your name mean? Plumeria. So cute. Okay, now this has this the chocolate leaked out a little. Done. No, you give it like this. You give this as a gift. Yeah, and you let them have it. If you want to take it out um, and just do it as a, sh you can either spray it or with the chocolate, heat this up and then cut it out. No, no, no. No, no, no. Cuando ya le calientas a este y le cortas, como que le estás derritiendo más o menos. This is a cute gift. This is really cute. This is a really cute gift also. Put it in a solophane bag, whatever, wrap it. Super simple, really cute. Okay, now 
the last one that I'm working on is the two-tone. This is another reason why I love these parchment papers because you make a mess on top of them and then you <laughs> throw them away. What does the child want? Tell them to go on. Have grandma take them. Alrighty. Um, we also do sell these little guys. Um, I have a whole bunch of these at home because when I'm baking, a lot of the stuff is like salt and stuff. It's just a pinch. So these are ideal. They're, you can reuse them or whatever if you wish. You don't have to if you don't want to. But we do sell these here. You can also make like sample. Um, uh, um, um, what's the dessert you like? Creme um, brulee in here. Flans in here. Perfect. Um, thank you. All right. Can I have the, the chocolate that's in the fridge, please? And the white is still good. Oh, I'm sorry. I was, ask, I was answering the question. This kid. Lower my phone. The best chocolate that I like is the super white, um, white chocolate. Um, perfect. It is white, very, very white. And that's actually what I'm using right now. So that's my favorite white chocolate. All righty. So I have my chocolate ready. My white chocolate's still a little melted. And I'm just going to pour it on top. And then I'm going to make sure it just goes over. And let's add the caramel on this one. How about that? So we can add the caramel on here. Um, the reason why, I don't know if you guys see it, but I've cut the caramel in chunks and I have them separated and they just like a bunch of little pieces onto the parchment paper. The reason why is if I cut it up and then I put it in one of these, the caramel eventually sinks together. So then I literally lost my five minutes of cutting <laughs> so that is why they're separated so i'm just gonna put them however i wish on here and um, i'll do a lot of this because i know that there's a little girl in the room that she likes caramel she'll try to take all of it hmm. all righty y si quiere lo puede hacer en pelota Whatever, pinch it. I'm not going to get all detailed. Uh-oh. <clears throat> Let's put a lot. Oh, look who here. UPS here. <laughs> Look at that. All right. Now, on the other half, what would you guys like? You want more of the Rice Krispies before it dries? What about pretzel? Pretzel, yeah. We have more pretzel here. This is a time to do whatever. Yes. Imagine your, you can even put fruit. In yeah. yeah. Especially like the dried fruit. Oh, so like the dried cranberries. This is, I love this because it's a super easy and ideal gift. Alrighty. So, done. Now, what do I have in the fridge? Nothing? Let me take these out. So what? Oh. And now I have the white chocolate bar ready. Hi, we were just talking about you. Oh, yes. Estamos hablando de usted. Uh, la señorita Silvia, la que da la clase de la gelatina. Okay, so here it is. Ahora está bien delgadito. 
Mina. Just get it out of the way. There we go. Clean parchment paper. Now, if you see, it's really, really thin. It's so thin I can kind of see the side. Okay. And now we're going to crack this one. I'll just do it with the hand. Yeah, very, very easy. This one has nothing. Yeah, I would just remelt this because it has nothing. The yogurts are coming off. Here, I'll throw this over here. Sí, pero no se detenieron mucho estos. Yeah, and they were drying by the time I was putting them on. Okay. And also the chocolate's really thin, so it's not holding on to it really good. But that's okay. You get one, you get enough. All right. Chocolate bark. White chocolate bark. The minis would work ideal. Alrighty. Now, my other one might be set. Here we go. Did you grab me? <laughs> you saw it? She always gets me in the worst. Oh, I feel like she's my bloopers. Okay. Can you bring me the other one out and see if it's done? These I can use again or just eat them. <laughs> just put them in here. Okay. Done. Es de los dos colores. You see, so you get two. Yes. <laughs> and this is still not done. I feel it's very soft. Look. Yeah, it still needs to be more. Um, so you get so you get rougher edges. Like really, this one's still like. Eh. I'm gonna let it sit a little longer. But that's really it. Put it back in the fridge for me. Um, these are the best ones that you can do for gifts. So if you have any questions, let me know. I have one recipe that somebody can take, if whoever wants it. And um, next week we'll do the wreath cake. The week after that we're gonna do a Christmas strudel. Candy cane strudel shape? Strudel. 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 Just like I said something wrong yesterday. I just remembered. In <laughs> um, January, I will have the calendar for you, well, for the demos. I'm working on it today. If you have any questions, do you have any suggestions on some guest artists or guest instructors, please message me. I will reach out to them and see what they can do. <laughs> Stop it. Um, and that's it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channels. We have Baker's Bodega Express. And also mine is under Pepsi Cakes. <laughs>